Uh, go ahead and push out here. And Raffle, you got it. Yeah, I... I am having some trouble in that I can't bring up Tab to see all of the loadouts and stuff like that, but that's okay. I'll just do it with the fly camera. That's what I've been waiting for this whole time. So Sig is making a very dominant push out into the water, whereas SJR is looking to push up towards uh, Arch. Um, so Sig is actually, they're very clumped up. All of their mechs are moving down through this water position towards boat. They're taking a few shots at any exposed mechs that SJR has. But for the most part, uh, they're just trying to make this advance. I'm not sure what position they're going for. So with this being skirmish, there's no objective, so they can't necessarily uh, flank in and like take the base or something like that. So I'm not sure uh, exactly what they're doing, but it looks like SGR is kind of fanning back out on the shore here, hiding in the hill near Greats, trying to get as many shots on them as they can while Sig moves up. Uh, it looks like Sig has brought plenty of PPCs and AC-20s, so they could be going for a brawl. But with that that number of PPCs, I can't imagine that. Uh, two UAVs go up from SJR, making sure that they see it. And it, yeah, it does look like SIG is trying to push in. They've got a lot of mechs moving in, and SJR is kind of falling back from this position that they were in back behind this bridge. So that SIG is only going to have a couple of approach routes if they want to come at them. The firing seems to have died down for the moment, but I, I have to say I'm not super sure about the position that SIG is in right here. Uh, more UAVs going up. I think that one was from SIG, just to make sure that they're not getting surrounded or pushed in on. But uh, I think SJR is probably going to try and wait till they get a pick. Uh, they seem more confident in their positioning right now. We've got uh, Jenner and a Shadowhawk, it looks like, moving up across the bridge, uh, trying to get in behind these guys. But the, they're, they're out from their team. The majority of their team is still way far behind. If they get spotted by SJR, that's going to be three easy kills. got the standard uh, jump battle going on. We're all used to it here in the competitive community. Um, so SGR is pushing out a little bit farther into the water, taking a few shots as they do, but it looks like they're sort of trading. SIG is beginning to push across that river by the culverts, trying to gain the access to that hill, and SGR does look like it's going in for the push now. Uh, shots going down to the culvert. They're trying to get SIG while they're split up right now because SIG has some mechs on the other side of that river and some on this side. We've got a Victor. Uh, Shadowhawk goes down for SIG uh, and a Cataphract as well. They're pushing in on this Victor Lego Pirate and uh, a Shadowhawk goes down. This Victor's all caught by himself. Victor goes down. SGR is pushing through. It seems that there only are only a few mechs left. Taking down four already. And SIG is on the back foot now. They're trying to wheel away. A couple of their lights going in, trying to get a good pick. But all of the heavies from SJR are there pushing in. Unfearing is caught in between the uh, wide open space and a bunch of jump snipers. It looks like he's trying to make the best of it. A cataphract goes down. Oh, no, cataphract is not down. Roughneck is still up. He just loses an arm. As SJR pushes down uh, and over this hill into SIG, they're just kind of playing a whole little bit of uh, ring around the rosy, it looks like. Uh, Victor goes down for SIG, and SJR continues to just kind of roll around in this slow, looping fashion. Couple mechs left from SIG holding out, but that's, uh, that's game for SJR. They take it. That was a good match. You can see uh, damage numbers here. We've got uh, SJR around the 300 to 400 range. There was uh, three members of the SIG team that didn't break 100. And you know that definitely hurts, obviously. Usually a milestone is a lot of people like to to at least aim for, what, 200? Uh, if you can 200 do... is a pretty good yeah. mark. If you're, uh, if, you're playing, if you're playing really cautiously or you're doing a certain role, it's, it's likely that you can get under that. I've seen people get like four kills with 130-some damage, so... It, it all depends, but yeah, you, you tend to want to be a little higher on the board. And I mean, if we look at the setups, they're pretty much identical. Um, three Dragon Slayers for three Dragon Slayers, Cataphracts, three Deltas, just like how we called it. It's a pretty uh, standard uh, setup, um, albeit the, the main difference is uh, sometimes you might see a light. Sometimes they'll do a ECM, a 3L, or a Cicada, but not in this, uh, not in our HOD. 